Most vodka doesn't even come from the United States, much less your own backyard. Tahoe Blue Vodka is a premium vodka that is out there making some waves. The name is perfect, the recipe is unique, and the owners have even managed to throw in a little bit of philanthropy. With a great taste and a beautiful bottle, the world, or should I say water, is at their feet. The product name actually came from the philanthropic movement to help preserve Lake Tahoe. Like keep Tahoe Blue, so Tahoe Blue Vodka seemed like a good route to go for a brand name and uh, we wanted to try and help protect the lake so we donate a portion of proceeds back to those nonprofits to help preserve Lake Tahoe. Well I have to tell you, I, I think the name is ingenious because when you think about Lake Tahoe, that's exactly what you think about. It's one of the most beautiful places in the world. You think about it being pristine and clear and beautiful and that's what you want your vodka to taste like, right? Yeah. And this bottle, you did a great job of capturing kind of the lake image on the bottle. It's absolutely wonderful. Now, Chris, I'm going to ask you, um, what really sets Tahoe Blue Vodka apart? What makes it different from all the other great vodkas out there? Well, we took a different approach to the vodka. Most vodkas are distilled from one thing, call it, you know, wheat or uh, potatoes is another popular one. Ciroc, Ciroc does grape, which is, you know, the big thing. Well, our distiller down in Mountain View, California, does a lot of award-winning uh, liquors mm -hmm. and he uh, he suggested the idea of doing a blended vodka which no one else is doing much like um, yeah. Crown Royal is a, it's a blended whiskey he said let's do a blended vodka so came up with a combination of distilled grapes grain and sugar cane and the grain in that is actually corn so it is a uh, gluten-free product and he hand distills everything he's got an old Alambic style still down in Mountain View and what a great original idea it's it's pretty magical I mean this is the smoothness that Matt was talking about uh, is fully there when you drink the vodka. So let's talk about, you guys have won some serious awards with this vodka, Matt. Tell me which ones. Well, uh, we've entered Tahoe Blue Vodka in four of the probably eight big tasting competitions. They're in Denver, Los Angeles, San Francisco, and New York. And we've actually come home with medals in all of those. Uh, the most recent was the Ultimate Spirits Challenge, that's the one in New York, and that's kind of widely accepted as the most respected of those competitions. And you got and an award. We took superlative first place. First the place. Best tasting unflavored vodka. Right that's here right. with our own local vodka. That's right. That's amazing. So, I mean, like, how does it make you guys feel, seriously, when you go to a competition like this and your vodka wins? Like, how does that make you feel like you've created something that people love? Well, 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 Based on the size of our company and where we're at, we have yet to attend one of these vodka tastings. Therefore, we know that we're winning without shoveling, bribing right. anybody. No which is, right. right. And uh, so when we hear back, the, the first time we heard back, we won a silver medal out at, at San Francisco. We were ecstatic. Or, that, or no, I'm sorry, that was LA. But when we found out that we beat out in New York, Chopin, Belvedere, Pearl, American Harvest. I mean, these are the big dogs that have tens of millions of dollars behind them and it, it makes us realize why we keep doing what we're doing because it is it's a tough gig having you know jobs a regular job Tahoe Blue Vodka you know, yeah. we're all involved with our families and our young kids as you know Jen yeah and I mean obviously you guys have created something really spectacular so let's let's tell people where they can get it at There's lots of ways to experience Tahoe Blue Vodka right well of course you can order it just like you can order any vodka in your local bar or restaurant you can also get a bottle to take home with you at Ben's, Whispering Vine, uh, Scolari's, Raley's, Whole Foods, most of the places you buy liquor. Yeah, Total Wine too, right? Total Wine as well, yeah. So I can go into a bar or restaurant and where I normally would ask for a Grey Goose Martini, mm -hmm. um, I can ask for a ta Tahoe Blue Vodka Martini. That's correct. That's awesome. You guys, thank you so much. Congratulations on all your success. Thank you Thanks, for having Jim. us. Appreciate it very much. Tahoe Blue Vodka is a whole new approach to vodka, with the end result being an incredible vodka in an elegant package. And don't forget, the Tahoe Blue Vodka is green, donating a percentage of the proceeds to help preserve the lake. Each time you drink Tahoe Blue Vodka, take pride in the fact that you're helping preserve the pristine beauty that is Lake Tahoe. Well, we've told you how great the vodka is, and now we're gonna show you. Coming up next in tonight's show is our very own Bloody Mary contest held at Soto, one of the hottest restaurants in town, and featuring Tahoe Blue Vodka.